and South Africans love to complain. We see negativity. We, we don't want to acknowledge that there are some things we are doing right. When you grow up in such poverty, you just want to have shoes. You didn't dream too far. My father used to say to me, I don't care what you do. You have to be more educated than I am. At least pass standard six. It was scary. I've never seen that many white people at a time. That was also a cultural learning for the Canadians to see a little black African woman saying, yeah, yeah, I know chemistry. They went through a cultural shock. I love it. Professor Tavello was born in a rural South Africa and I think one of the fascinating things about a woman of her education now is that she spent one day shepherding the sheep, <laughs> the other day at school they had to alternate because somebody needed to look after the livestock. My days as a shepherd prepared me for being a scientist without knowing it at that particular time. Do you think they give you food when you go to the farm? No, they feed you in the morning. You come back in the evening to eat. You have to figure out what is edible and what is not edible in the field. You have to learn the birds, you have to learn the sounds. That is science, you know. I strongly oppose the fact that girls will be told to go and do home economics while boys are doing woodwork. Don't discourage anybody on the basis of gender from any subject. Why shouldn't boys cook? Discipline, doing everything on time is my philosophy. My children know that. There's no reason that the schools are still not functional. But teachers being in class, learners understanding they must be in class, a, a, a discipline in understanding that we need to make something better of ourselves. I feel blessed to be surrounded by these beautiful things. We cannot throw away people with the skills as long as they are passing them on. If you are white, you are male, you are female, whatever the case, if you are helping the country, if you are training other people, the next generation, I'm happy with you. Looking at me, Professor? Professor Tabello is an extraordinary example of how people transcend their upbringing, transcend their childhood and, and grow into something that is really, really remarkable. This country is leading in many, many aspects. I want to be able to show young people that creativity and development doesn't only come from Europe, Asia, or America. It can be done here. The opportunities are there. We just have to take them and use them.